Hey everybody, Ricky and I'm handicapping thoroughbred racing from Hollywood Park on Saturday afternoon, December the 10th, and this is my Equibase Winter Circle Southern California race of the day. Let's take a look at the big feature this afternoon here at Hollywood Race 9, 4.35 p.m. Pacific Post Times is the Hollywood Starlet Stakes, 8.5 furlongs on the cushion track, grade 1, 2-year-old fillies race for an unusual purse of 402 thousand dollars. Contenders number two, Charm the Maker. Number one, We Miss Frankie. Number four, Killer Graces. And number three, Lady Pecan. Number two, Charm the Maker is the overall speed leader in the stakes field this afternoon. Has hit the board in power run fashion each of her three career starts to date, winning twice in this recent streak of racing consistency. Jockey Garrett Gomez was in her irons for each of those three board hit races is back today for his fourth ride gunning for a hat trick win. The morning line favorite is number one, me we Miss Frankie, who takes a slight class drop as the pace profile leader, has hit the board in each of her four respective starts to date, winning three. Two of those winning efforts also qualifying as power run wins. Race 9 summary number 2, Charm the Maker, tops the contenders list this afternoon, which also includes number 1, We Miss Frankie, number 4, Killer Graces, and number 3, Lady Pecan. 2 1 4 3 in the ninth from Hollywood, the $402,000 grade 1 Hollywood Starlet Stakes. Bonus long shots, Beulah Park, race 3, number 5, tap to B, 5 to 1 in the morning line, drops in class by 13 units. It's the speed leader in this field, racing at or about today's distance of a mile and 70 yards on the dirt. Hawthorne race course near Chicago, race 4, the 6 to 1 shot, number 5, test market, takes a two-track master class drop. Overall speed leader in this claiming field, sprinting at or about today's distance of 6 furlongs on the dirt. So from Hollywood Park on a Saturday afternoon, Rick Needham for the Equibase Winter Circle reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.